Hi, my name is Elijah Kirby. I lead North Point Care, an organisation recently set up to serve and reform the UK foster care system. But more than that, to see the tens of thousands of lives in that system totally transformed. I believe right now the church is positioned in a once in a generation opportunity and place to see the care system reformed. Why? Because there's massive need. The local authorities' budgets have been hugely reduced. The number of children coming into care has shot up. And sadly, the children, when they're in care, the results and the outcomes just aren't across the board where they should be. We look at some of the most harrowing stats nationally, from those who make up the prison population to those who commit domestic violence to those who struggle with substance misuse. It's care leavers that make up those stats. And also, sadly, those in care, stats tell us once they leave care and have children themselves, that their children will then be taken into care. And on the cycle of brokenness goes. Just imagine if the local church over the next 10, 15 years can lead the way in reforming the system so that what we model becomes the model that other organisations and agencies and local authorities say that's the standard we're going for. And you know what? It's dead achievable. I think we can do it. And so a couple of years ago, uh, being a care leaver myself, I had some ideas and I thought we've got to do something. And there was two factors that happened to me that I think we want to put into play nationally. One was a loving family. I mean, a loving family who loved me unconditionally. Arms around, wouldn't let go. They were superb. And that began to transform me. Did you know that when we encounter sustained, unconditional love, that our brains are rewired? In fact, the damage can be completely undone and reversed. And so it was a loving family and also the local church, God's vehicle of transformation. And I believe when we go with those two arms, the local church and loving families, that actually we can begin to model something quite profound. And so we took that to local authorities who said, wow, there's nobody doing what you're doing and suggesting. That model that you've proposed is so unique across the nation. We love your story, Elijah. You've been in the system. You get it. We love that. But also we need some help right now. And so we're going to partner with you. And so we've partnered with local authorities. We've got about 100 churches with us so far as we trial this in the northeast. And we think what we do here can be replicated across the UK. I mean, I'm thinking about those thousands of lives. I'm thinking about the impact of what we could do, the outcomes of the children that we could work with, who could go on and love their wives. Maybe some will come to faith. Amazing. But maybe they won't. Maybe some will be teachers, doctors, great partners, people who grow up understanding who they are, why they're made. Maybe there's a future prime minister in the offering there. Imagine the impact if we can get this right and do it the way that we think it should be done.